It's unlike any other game in the world. Buddy Franklin under the scene. Franklin, this is Buddy Franklin! Otherwise known as Aussie Rules, AFL or footy, Australian football is chock-a-block full of non-stop action, athleticism, hard hits, and uh, heart-stopping moments. Seed from the boundary. Needs to be inch perfect. Yes! This is Australia's game. Not even kidding. The professional men's league, the AFL, is the most attended domestic sports league in the world per capita. It's made up of 18 teams across the country. The AFLW is the women's competition, formed in 2017 and growing rapidly ever since. Righto, let's talk some basics. On game day, two teams play each other on a field shaped like an oval. A starting lineup consists of defenders, midfielders and forwards. You gotta be fit to play this sport. Players can move anywhere on the ground and perform any role during the game. Games are split into four quarters, with time added for stoppages in play. And the game starts with players from both teams fighting for possession of the ball. We are away and Grundy out the back was able to get it to Pendlebury. The aim is to move the ball down the field and score. This is done in one of three ways. You can't throw the ball, but you can use your fist to punch the ball out of your hands. That's a handball. You can run with the ball, but don't forget to bounce it every 15 metres. Penny! Oh, he's in a good spot! Penny with the bounce! Here's the moment! Penny with the second bounce! And finally, you can kick the ball. Ah, uh, no. Yeah, that's better. Trelaw. Kicks it beautifully, look at that ball. Players try to catch the ball after it's been kicked at least 15 metres. This is called a mark. Fun fact, you can use your opponent as a stepladder and take what's called a specky. Wait, that's legal? <laughs> after a mark, you can choose to play on. Or you can stop and take an unobstructed kick. To score, the idea is to kick the ball between the two large upright posts. There's the target, and that's right on the Ooh, That's a goal. That's six points. By the way, you can also kick goals like this. This, or even this. No way! Still with Martin. Can he kick a fourth? Oh, he has! Hit the post, or put it between the big posts and the outer lower post. Ah, uh, how did he miss that? That's worth one point. We call that a behind. After a goal is scored, the ball goes back to the centre square and the action starts again. Surely not another one. And Walter Oliver streaming through. Bang! Bang, bang, bang! So, how do you get the ball back from your opponents? You can spoil, bump, smother and tackle. Is it true they don't wear pads? And bang! Once tackled, your opponent must correctly dispose of the ball. Yeah, nah, not like that. If they don't, and have had prior opportunity to do so... On the footy! This is called holding the ball, and you get a free kick. When the final siren sounds, the team with the most points wins. Come on! What an upset! A final scoreline can look confusing, but it's actually pretty simple. Start with the goals, these are worth six, remember? Add your behinds, and that's your total score. Before we go, let's take a quick look at how the professional seasons work. In the women's competition, the top teams play off in a knockout final series, culminating in a grand final played at the highest ranking team's home ground. In the men's league, teams fight it out for 22 home and away games. And after that, the top eight teams make the finals. One by one, teams get knocked out until two remain, ready to face off in the grand final. It's the decider for the biggest prize in footy, the Premiership Cup. Played at the MCG in front of, hold up, this can't be right, 100,000 fans. You beauty. What a game of footy. And that's pretty much it, your quick guide to Aussie rules football. So this is us. What do you reckon? Because personally, we think it's the best live game going round. But don't take our word for it. Grab your scarf and come see for yourself. You're gonna love it.